How clean is clean? To answer this recurring question, you need to measure. Today, there are dozens of commercially available acoustic meters. These devices are used by inserting a probe into an ultrasonic cleaning tank. But what if you could acoustically measure inside the tank from the outside? This would avoid disrupting the acoustic field, cumbersome fixtures, and exposure to harsh chemistries. With Onda's Continuous Monitoring Sensor, CMS, you can. The CMS sensor kit is designed to mount to the exterior of an ultrasonic cleaning tank, where the sensor can be easily replaced, very similar to a stethoscope used in a doctor's office. This provides the opportunity to upgrade cleaning lines. The kit includes the housing, sensor, spring, and locking piece. Epoxy and a coupling agent is also included. To mount the housing onto the tank, mix the epoxy until the color becomes uniform. Apply a light even layer of the epoxy onto the housing. Remove the adhesive tabs. Ensure the tank wall is clean and place the housing at the desired location. Allow 15 to 24 hours to fully cure. Apply the coupling agent onto the face of the sensor and spread evenly. Place the sensor, spring, and locking piece into the housing. The locking piece should be securely tightened by hand. To ensure the measurement accuracy, Calibrate the CMS with the HCT320 measuring inside the tank. Connect the CMS to the MCT2000 meter. Start a tap session and acquire a data point. Disconnect the CMS with the MCT2000 and reconnect it with the HCT320. Acquire another data point. Then, press the end tap button. Using the IP address found at the bottom right corner of the display, open a web browser to type in the address. This will take you to the MCT2000 software. Go to the File Manager tab and find the data acquired from the CMS and HCT320. The file names are labeled with a date and timestamp by default. Rename these files so they are more obvious. Download the files locally to your laptop. Go to the Settings tab and click on the Apply Matching Offset checkbox. Upload the Spectrum files. The HCT320 should be the reference and the CMS should be the test. After Matching Offset is applied, press Apply. The CMS should now spectrally match with the HCT320. Now, let's convert measurements from the MCT2000 to the MCT1200. To do so, acquire a set of MCT2000 data points. Go to the MCT2000 data. Connect the CMS to the MCT1200. Note the average values and input these reference values into the MCT1200. Press record. Press record to generate a scale factor. Make sure the scale factor is applied. The MCT-1200 has now been self-calibrated with the MCT-2000 and the CMS has been self-calibrated with the HCT-320. You are now ready to continuously monitor the acoustic output in your cleaning tank. You'll notice that as we change the generator power, the acoustic pressure measurements also change. Detecting real-time process excursions is now possible.